Mary Beth Thornton is joining us right now. She is the board president for the New Mexico Center for Nursing Excellence. Mary Beth, it is great to have you with us. David, thank you for having me this morning. Definitely. Let's talk a little bit about the organization and give some background for the viewers. Okay. The Center for Nursing Excellence was developed by nurses um, to support nursing throughout the state of New Mexico and improve the health of New Mexicans. At the center, um, one of our um, goals is to um, improve nursing practice, nursing education, um, and have nurses prepared to better take care of our community. Wow. And one great way that we can show some appreciation for nurses is National Nurse Week. When is that taking place? So National Nurses Week starts on May 6th, and it ends in International Nurses Day on May 12th, which happens to be Florence Nightingale's birthday. And Florence Nightingale was the mo mother of modern nursing. And so each year internationally, we celebrate her birth uh, at for Nurses Week. So during Nurses Week, it's a good opportunity for people to be able to recognize nurses who have made a difference for them. Um, we also kick off our Nursing Excellence Awards during uh, Nursing Week. And this is a way for uh, nurses who are doing an outstanding job to be recognized in 19 different categories. One of those categories is the Touch of Life category. And those are awards that the community can recognize a nurse who has made a difference in their life or the life of a family member. And they can go on our website at nmnursingexcellence.org and nominate a nurse for the Nursing Excellence Award. Um, and these are very touching stories that we hear from families and patients who nurses have made a significant impact in their life. Yeah. And no doubt it's been quite the significant impact, especially now during the pandemic year uh, and, and everything that nurses have done during that time. And of course, you know, all the years and time after that or before that. Um, right now, let's talk about uh, if you can share a story of a previous winner. Sure. Thank you, David. Um, I'm going to share a story of a nurse that I worked with um, who is a pediatric nurse who um, works in the pediatric intensive care unit. And um, we care for a lot of patients who have long lengths of stay and a lot of care needs when they return home to their family. Um, this child was going home with significant equipment needs, significant medical needs that the family was going to have to manage at home. This nurse saw that the family, both the parents and the grandparents, were struggling to learn all of the different care that their baby was going to need when they went home. So in order to make it easier for the parents, she developed a handwritten schedule so that they could follow it along with videos and written materials so that that family had a notebook to take home with them that they could reference any time when they were home. Having that as a backup support system to them when they may, uh, went home allowed them to give their child outstanding care because we don't have nurses in the home 24 seven. Nurses check in with families when they go home but the parents and grandparents are the ones who ultimately do that care. So this nurse took it upon herself to ensure that that parent and that grandparents were ready to go home and have that child in their home rather than being hospitalized. Wow. No doubt one story of many and many that are out there. And again, uh, that's, uh, that's what you want right now to hear those kind of stories for somebody that's going to be nominated for, uh, for this, uh, for this uh, nursing excellence right now. So, uh, Let's uh, give everybody at home, if you would, please, uh, a website of where we can find more information. Okay. So they'll want to go to our website, nmnursingexcellence.org, and the instructions on how to nominate a nurse and tell their story are on the website, as well as uh, frequently asked questions that people can review. So uh, please go and nominate a nurse who's made a difference in your life. Thank a nurse during National Nurses Week. Um, and we so much appreciate the ability for us to have these Nursing Excellence Awards and KRQE has sponsored us and been a major sponsor for us for a number of years. And we appreciate your support as well as our other community sponsors. Well, thank you. And definitely our pleasure to be able to, to have uh, a small hand in, uh, and again, thanking all the nurses out there for everything they do for us. Mary Beth, thank you for joining us. Dave, thank you for having me today. Take care. You too.